I am so happy to be doing another podcast. <laughs> I tell you, I've missed this. This is fun. I, I, I love connecting with our people and, you know, and, 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 you know, sharing our funny stories yeah. and answering questions. I, I feel like I have been so out of the loop. I know. You know I'm, I'm sure you do also. I do. And, but it's over. We did it. We did do it. We okay. launched our product. I haven't spent this many hours on any single project. Honestly, I can't remember when. Uh, probably when I was in public accounting. Got in the car, drove the area where we're buying some houses right now, and and literally handed out our own flyers to you know get some more excitement for our open house that we're going to have tomorrow. I, I just can't wait because I really think tomorrow is going to be the day that we're going to have an open house. Jack and I are going to be there, and it's going to be awesome. And we'll we'll do a. I promise I will do a video from the open house so you can just really see this asset and, and see what we're doing here with House Academy. How long does it take me? So we just came up with a magical, well, you could do it in 45 days. That was yeah. what it started. And then we we dissected it in, in a couple different places, like on the show and then in a blog. And then I really dissected it in a newsletter. Um, so I'll cover it loosely here, just to give you an idea. But it's because I wanted people to see that you can really do it while having a full-time job and only doing a couple hours um, on the weekend yeah. you know, or, or on a Tuesday night, you know, whenever you have time, whatever it is. I, my, my thing is, okay, Sunday afternoon, you know, everybody's that time when the kids are playing out back and the wife's cooking a nice dinner and you have some time to get on the computer, you can do this. Right. At 404, you've actually done a few deals where where you've, you're rolling your own eyes saying, wow, you know, yeah. I, I'm not sure I can do it top that. Right. I'm not sure I can do a deal that that's that this mail campaign thing that all these that actually turns out it works. <laughs> can I parlay that into make making every deal a million bucks? Right. Or every deal 2.6 million. Exactly. Absolutely, you can. Jill and I do it all the time. Yep. You have to make a make a, a mental switch in your head and and tell yourself, I'm doing this now, but I'm not going to be doing this in six months. I'm going to outsource that's right. this and outsource this. That's right, Joe. If you want to get ahead, you are you are as you're going through these um, big beginner steps, you're starting to plan for your exit and your replacement because you should be doing bigger and better things, better deals, more important um, tasks. You're planning for that. That's how you go month over month. The consequence of sending X amount of mail out and then sending out Y more is totally predictable. Right. You have complete control over it. So if you want to buy a house and you send out 3,000 units, let's say, you're going to buy a house. Right. For every 2,500 mailers that we sent out, we're, we bought a house and made between 25000 and $75,000. Well, I did this for a really long time, for decades without Joe, and it was a whole different, just, well, you probably run, do you run your construction company by yourself entirely, or does she help you there too? She does the books. <laughs> uh, the construction That's probably why you're still in business. Yeah, right. Um, <laughs> we're very ambitious. We're very much go-getting, but we're also, you know, Samantha's extremely intelligent, and she's able to really do that part of the job so much better than, you know, I could ever do. So, you know, why would I? I've long said that these roles choose us. We don't choose them. You know, I'm, I didn't choose, to, I didn't set out to be the data person. It's just how, who I am, and that's it. Yeah. Why am I doing this whole thing anyway? Why am I in the land business? Is it here to collect land to have for my portfolio so when I die, I have 8,000 acres? No, that is not the point of why I'm in this business, right? No, we're here to buy and sell land. And, and it sure helps if you're a land person. As we're driving around um, Colorado right now, like all over Colorado, let me tell you, pretty much all up and down the front range, let's just, we'll say that. It's pretty flipping cool and it's so beautiful. And I keep, everywhere I look, I have these, you know, breathtaking, awe-inspiring for me views. And it could be, maybe it's a mountain, maybe it's just a, it's just a rolling, rolling field, you know, something like that. But I was thinking about it and I realized, you know, I really am a land person and it really helps me in everything that we do. We're Jack and Jill. Information and inspiration to buy undervalued property.